Cisco One is a new way to consume software from Cisco. In this video, I'm going to discuss how to place an order for on-premise wireless using Cisco One. The fact is, is that Cisco One, as an offering to, uh, to customers, is the most fair and the most simple that we've had in, uh, in anything that we've had in the past. Because the fact is, is that you start with the wireless LAN controller. You pick the controller that best meets your needs, and that controller is devoid of licenses or any kind of software. You're simply just getting the hardware. And for service, you simply pay for the service on the hardware. For the access point, you just pick the best access point that works for you. It's kind of a good, better, best sort of model. Do I want to have enterprise class features? Do I want to have future proof and expandability? Pick your access point. Those access points come with a five year limited lifetime warranty. And that means that five years past end of sale, we'll continue to support that, that access point, including a 10 day advanced replacement. And then for each and every access point, you get a single Cisco One foundation access license. This license is $350 per access point at list price, and there are discounts for volumes. So for more than 500 or more than 1,000, the price goes down. And for each one of those licenses, there's a simple $53 per year software maintenance contract, and that entitles you to the full suite of products. Not only do you get prime infrastructure and assurance and the MSE base location, and the identity services engine for 25 devices per license. You also get a controller AP adder license, and that's where your controller licenses come, in, come into play. And all of these licenses are portable. If you don't already have prime infrastructure, you're gonna to need to have the prime infrastructure base software. And that's about $120 list price with a $25 service price. And then if you also don't have the Mobility Services Engine Virtual Appliance, you'll need to get that. The maintenance for the, Mo the MSE is included in Cisco One, so there's no need to get separate maintenance for that. And if you want to get the Identity Services Engine Virtual Appliance because you don't already have it, you would get that there and there would be some maintenance costs associated with that. Now, I know this is a little bit of an eye chart, but this helps walk you through putting an order together in Cisco Commerce Workspace at cisco.com slash go slash ccw. First off, we start off with our access point. Again, you pick the access point that makes the most sense uh, for your deployment. And then you pick the controller that makes the most sense for your deployment. Of course, just so that uh, I, you know it's, it's simple, I didn't include all of the controller options here. However, uh, there are more options than is listed on this list, but as you can see, uh, they're, uh, they're, they're pretty much in line with the pricing. The 5508 uh, is the exception here. Uh, the 5508 uh, is $12,500. That's just simply the cost of the hardware. And again, you get the SmartNet associated with that. For high availability, you wanna make sure that you get a high availability controller and you can see the SKUs here. This orange section, consider this a bit of a one-time setup cost, right? If you don't have prime infrastructure base, you'll want to get that. If you don't have the MSC, you're going to need to get that. If you don't have the ICE virtual appliance, you need to get that. All of the separate licenses are included in Cisco One, and these are actually a component of the controller. So when you add c one air dash CT5508-K9, uh, as you can see up in the purple section, one of the options is gonna be the Cisco One Access Foundation licenses, and you just simply add the number of APs to that, and that automatically adds the uh, licenses. Also, if you have um, larger quantities, you'll find in the controller where you can specify the larger quantity uh, discounts. And then for some of the advanced services on your enterprise wireless network, like Cisco Mobility Experiences or Adaptive Wireless IPS, 
the licenses are included as the as as part of the Cisco One Access Advanced license, and you can see those here. Thanks for your time. I hope this helps, and I uh, look forward to any questions that you might have.